Hey besties, so what I'm going to be doing today is a design for the rib rolls. I am doing this in Cricut, but I'm actually only going to use scissors to cut it out. I'm not going to use the machine uh, because I have another project going on on my Cricut right now. So I'm going to go ahead and put the design together. Of course, I'm going to give you guys the measurements first and then we will get into the design portion. The dimensions that I'm going to use are the 6.25 by 4.7. So I will go ahead and enter in the clip art that I'm gonna use and then I will get right back to the design portion. So I kind of have everything set up the way that I want it. I'm going to go ahead and include their ages on there. They are turning one and two. Um, but I'm not going to include their names. I'm just doing Bam Bam and Pebbles. To check and make sure that I'm staying within the correct dimensions, I always measure out each space. So for the two sides, it's going to be 1.75 by 4.7. And that's going to be for this section right here. And then I'll duplicate this in this section right here. Okay. That way I can just line up everything nice and neat in, in the center and go from there. Okay, so the front of your wrapper is going to be uh, 2.75 and then the two sides are going to be 1.75 just to make sure that you can space everything out correctly. So now I'm going to go ahead and select everything together and click flatten. I'm gonna go in here to make it. I'm gonna go ahead and click continue, send to printer, and then I'm gonna print on the Canon Pigma and go to advanced options. Here is my rip roll here and I'm just going to stuff it in there and then I will put a tiny bit of glue at the top. Okay. 
and then just squeeze. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and just crimp this. So this is the end result of the Rip Raw Wrapper. It was done on Hammer Mill Laser Gloss. If you guys have any questions regarding this video, please let me know down below in the comments. I thank you guys as always for watching. And of course, I'll see you in the next video.